Hi, I'm Dr. Erin Bowers, and I'm a pediatrician in Lake Mary, Florida. So that's a big question we get is what's the difference between colds and allergies? And it's very easy to get confused because the symptoms are the same, the runny nose, the sneezing. The big ticker is do they have a fever? If they have a fever, we lean more towards colds. If you have itchy eyes, that can be kind of in between. So maybe that leads more to us feeling like allergies. And it's triggered a lot by outside. Right now is tree pollen season. So a lot of kids spend outside on the playgrounds and they're going to outdoor activities like sports. And then they're coming home and they're having all these symptoms. Parents note that they're always going like this. They're always going and sniffing through. So that's a big sign that they have allergies. My big tips are making sure that we're having a regimen that we can stick to daily. So it's important that we take our antihistamine, which can usually work from 12 to 20 24 hours. I like to give it at night because the big side effect of an antihistamine is sleepiness. And then if that doesn't work, we can always use a nasal steroid, um, which are also available over the counter. And when you do those, I always tell parents, make sure your child's chin is to your chest, and then you're going to spray out towards their eyes. Not just spraying up because then they're just swallowing it, but we want to spray out towards their eyes in each nostril. It's important that when you've used over-the-counter medicines for allergies, such as your oral medications, and it hasn't had an improvement, or you've used the nasal steroids and you're still not getting a lot of relief, it's important to see your pediatrician to see if you need to go to allergy to get more testing or more therapies. There is options available, such as immunotherapy, which can be given sublingually or injections into our skin. But again, it's important that those are done by a trained allergist or if there is testing done, that it's done by a trained professional on how to interpret those results.